It's a big thing. You guys know I love proving um, people wrong and proving information that I'm stating or, or facts or whatever the case may be. Now, I told you guys that I this is very important. Now, I told you guys I logged into this account recently. It was um, about two weeks ago, a week and a half, somewhere around there that I had just logged on the account and it was perfectly fine. Now, I went ahead and did my own inv investigation on myself and I was like, wait, I can go back to my history. Well, the history, it doesn't. For some reason, the history on on the Samsung phone using the Samsung uh, browser, it doesn't. It didn't show me the exact date. It didn't show me the exact date. But what I was able to go off of is I did fly to Florida for a few days, and I was gonna stay um, at the Seminole Amakli just because just because I so I can get a free hotel room and you know use that instead of coming out of pocket. So I was gonna use that. And I had just got an email, and I remember opening the email. I was like, oh, let me see about this. So I'm going to slide to the next picture here. So this is my history. Um, and you can see that I selected it's betonline.com. Now, if you scroll up, you see reservations.com, IBE, blah, blah, blah. And it says uh, Seminole Mockley, dot, 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 um, reservation.com. Now, I got that email, I opened that email, and then I went to the reservation. So that's how I was able to go ahead and invest, basically investigate myself and um, narrow that time that time frame, that timeline around. So let me go to what's very important so I can point it out here. And here it is. So as you can see, on August 25th, 2023, I got a response from scamonline.ag and... What states here, it says, I have reviewed your account and I can see that everything is okay, which I know it should be. With your account, the error you are getting is that the account is dormant. That's a lie because I just logged on perfectly fine. And I tell you guys that I log on every now and then. And even there's videos of me, of me going and like logging in and telling you guys little updates about little bonuses I've gotten and things like that. So I periodically log in. Now, there has been times that I did not log in for years at a time, um, months at a time, weeks at a time. And this has never happened. And the only reason this is sort of a big thing to, to me is because stuff like this starts to happen before my account gets like banned and I can't use it no more. It's happened three times, two times, two other times. Scam online, which I already made those videos. I posted on um, YouTube. I proved everything. I showed you guys everything. So forth and so on. And another website. It's like they come across these videos and they don't like what I have to say. And they silence me by just, that's the only thing that I can come up with. Because they're always contradicting themselves. And it's always playing out the same exact way. It plays out the same exact way. Now let's go on. Um, it says this occurred when the account has not been used in a long time. Again, a lie. I just, the 16th. The 16th. When I tried to log on, when this when I started this, I think it was the 22nd or the 23rd, which was just like a, two days ago. And it says, people provide us with the phone number and blah, blah, blah. Now, someone else, I again, this is just something that someone told me. I can't verify it. But someone else told me this. They sort of almost did this. Um, they were making a big fuss. Um, they started canceling things off cards. And they told me that um, the site was trying their best to get, you know, all of their information like phone number, updated address, blah, 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 this and that, and other information that didn't even seem irrelevant, and they, and they just didn't feel comfortable with it, so they just stopped using the site. And this is what's going on. Like, this is, this, they already asked me for my phone number, a whole bunch of other information, um, which I don't think and feel that they really need. And I'm just not going to give it up, but Regardless, I did go ahead and I did send them a phone number and a time to call me. And I'm still waiting. Now, I'm going to show you the second email because, again, like I said, it contradicts them. They, it's like, come on, get your lies straight. And you're going to see, uh, this is why I try to get everything in emails and written form so I can show you all. Because a lot of people, oh, no, these are companies. Why would they play these games? Why would they do this? Why would they do that? Because it's money. And money adds up.
So we're going to slide over. Here it is. August 25th. August 25th. 2023. 2023. Now, when I emailed them, I emailed them all within one thread. Every department. So they on the same thread. Now, listen to what this one says. It says, thank you so much for getting in touch with us. Whatever. Well, it says, as per email, please do note that we have picked up a duplicate account. Hence, the reason for the error message. Kindly, when you do log, do refer to account ID, blah, 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 blah. I only have one account. And the ID that they put there is the only ID I log in. You can you can probably say, hey, maybe you logged into a friend's on a friend's computer that ha that has been online. They picked up no nothing of the sort, nothing of the sort. I only have one. I haven't been using no VPN or anything like that. So no. And it, you can see it's the, in the time. The time was within minutes. I know I did blank out the time because again I try. <laughs> I try to just, you know, hide certain things so but so they won't pick up on me so fast. But I it's, I think they are already done, so I it really I guess it really don't matter. But I've made videos showing my screen name and this and that and so it's that's that's why um social media, other links and stuff like that. But um yeah, whatever. So I just want to show you guys that how it just doesn't make sense. It contradicts um, I'm constantly proving them that it's that's showing them and telling them and you know whatever information you're saying is just incorrect. But I'm not gonna make it a big thing. I just feel that soon this account will be permanently banned um, because again it's following the same the same nonsense as the other two um, ACR and it was another site. Um, I think ACR they said I I was threatening the um employee in an email and i took a screenshot and i showed you guys the email we went over the email um it was just full of nonsense and again it was always a time where my channel sort of jumped and even this time i think i should just take a screenshot and show you guys but i i want to be like jump into like a few thousand views a few thousand hours of watch um and that and you know just a couple of uh you know followers and unfollowers but, you know, in even searches, people searching out bed online, but also people searching my channel. And like I said, people are adding my videos to playlists now, um, which is cool because it's it's showing that, you know, people are, are, you know, at least I just want to warn people. I mean, you don't have to you don't have to listen if you don't want to. It's, it's fine. But just warning people of what could happen, what will happen, what possibly will happen, you know, just getting it out there. But again, I'm not going to make this a big thing, but I'm just showing you guys. Soon, you know, my account just may be permanently banned. So then I won't have access to any online to continue to show you guys. But, hey, I documented a lot. I documented enough to where a lot of people can come up with a great conclusion to how scammy and how rigged these sites are.